Hello there, welcome back to the channel. It's me, the White Seer. Shh, everyone's asleep. We're playing some more Asuka today. And yeah, in the last episode, we got our first villager who we've set to wood collection. Um, I decided to rest my character up to get, get the health back. Um, what we're going to do in this episode, we are going to attempt to summon two more villagers, which is what, 20 minutes in a 30 minute episode. So I need to kind of get up and crack on with mining these uh, Jotun Bloods here. We have, we have two, um, which will give us our first one. Then we have to go off and get the second one. Um, we're also going to have to build another couple of shelters. And I want to build the gathering and the stone cutting stations. And I also want to finish this. Um, firstly, this uh, uh, fire cover and a barbecue point and also the well as well. So plenty to do today. Um, we're going to get up now, even though it's 1am. I'm going to go over here and start, start, because we need to get on with this if we're going to actually get these people involved. So let's grab um, some of this stuff. There's some berries there actually as well, which is good because we've run out of food a little bit. Um, I think in the last playthrough we, we had a lot of mushrooms. Um, a lot of grey mushrooms, which are the ones that give you hallucinogenic experience. Um, and I think what we'll do is we'll try and eat those, because the villagers won't. If we eat them just before we sleep, then the kind of weird visions and stuff like that kind of wear off. Um, so we don't have to deal with green screen and all that kind of stuff happening. Um, which is kind of useful. Um, we don't want negative effects whilst we're actually trying to play. I think there are some positive effects though as well. Okay, I can't see. Okay, there is another one over there I can see. Um, just trying to look around without stalling the process. But yeah, there's one over there um, which we can run down to. I quite like this location as well because we're up high but we are also quite close to the sea. Is that an enemy over there? Let's see. I broke my pickaxe. That's not good. Did I have enough? I do have enough. Oh my nose. What's that thing that's waving around? Oh no, it's just a bush. It's okay. Scared by a bush. Let's get this um, going in here. Please be either a good stone collector or a good wood collector. Um, breaking stones is a challenge for me. I'm proficient in stone mining, but I eat more than the normal villager. And can cultivate plants during the spring season. Daylight devotion. And we're going to go for Oscar. Right, excellent. Next person is on the way. So sticks for this one I need, and sticks for this one. Wow, I need 20 sticks in total. What did this person manage to collect? Have they managed to get me any... Oh, wow. I'll take all of these sticks. Thank you very much for your service. Um, let's pop those in there. It's four o'clock in the morning and we are banging in the middle of the camp. Just to annoy everybody. Okay, that is now built. That is now on the way. This requires a barbecue add-on. Which is more sticks, obviously. And a little bit more rope as well. Uh, so firstly, do we have any... We have no... We have no fibers. Okay. Secondly... We should ignite this so we can see what's going on in camp. I like to have a lit fire in camp. There we go. Perfect. Um, now, we are going to need rope because we do need to now rebuild our pickaxe. Does this wood spot have space for fibre? I think it does not. It's thatch, isn't it? There is Jotun blood everywhere up here, which is great. So there's some fibres. Um, this is sticks. 
I was about to say, what the hell is that? But they're smolters, I think. It was the... Uh, it was a thing over there which looked like it was a lying down bear. I've still got a bit of PTSD from that. Okay, berries. Grab some berries. Got to eat. And this gives more flax. So we can start thinking about making some rope here. Um, and... I can make myself my pickaxe again. I need a blade. One blade. Great. Let's swap these guys around. Need some of those. What's done here? Might as well grab some more sticks from here. And I'll grab some more fibres. I know that we're going to have somebody in a minute to do this kind of stuff. But... I don't want to have to, like, come back out here. Because they're incompetent. Okay, the other thing we didn't do enough of in the last um, playthrough is we did not set up markers. Um, and I don't know what the rules are about markers, whether they supersede the previous markers. Like, they just go to the newest one. Or whether they... Is that more water though? Or whether they um, just have a they look at all of them. Because if they look at all of them, um, then we're just going to set our markers everywhere within a reasonable radius. Um, seems to be the best option. Okay, I don't want any downtime for my eye of Odin in this episode. What, four people, including myself, by day four. Let's take these four stones as well. Ouch. Splinter. I'm going to go finish mining that one that we started as well, over the other side. I just wanted to grab this whilst I was here. This. A large stone camps this way. I'm going to dump this in here. Um, right, now we have five minutes to get a shelter up and running. Um, Build this water well as well. I said I was going to get that done. Right, that is now complete. Um, next thing, shelter. As in here, um, we want to build a shelter now for our next worker. I guess it's I can't build it in here. So we will go over here. Oh, that's lifted that up. Okay. Okay, so it's a little bit of a raised bit there. Um, and actually, we might as well put two down because we're going to build another one. Um, so if they're raised up here, can I put one here? Will that raise that up as well? That's quite good because um, I do want to kind of link it together with roads and have like several le like levels and layers. Um, so there's those. Um, need four sticks for that one. Let's go and see how our wood guy's doing. Do you have four sticks for me? You do. So I can finish that barbecue thing. We can take the long sticks. So that's one. Let's build that. Excellent. 
Excellent. So that's now fully upgraded. Now, uh, we have two of these. I need five. So that's the next job. Because the guy can basically make his own... Um, he can come and be a builder until we have the the next thing kind of made, the stone collector. Great, it was on one. Right, okay, I need another one. A fresh one. That isn't down there, surrounded by enemies. Seeing one here. Have we built in a, we haven't built in a place where there are no Jotun blood? I think there was one that we saw over the other side over here. Okay, that's the one then. Determined, determined to get this going as soon as the other guy arrives and then we'll set up the stone collection station and uh, we'll then get the shelters built. It's only 12 o'clock noon so we've got what, 10 hours before they need to sleep. Come on, we, we need we need the things, it's not giving me the things. Okay, there's one. So there's definitely going to be two here. Also, another thing, I'm hoping that they've sorted out the uh, copyright issues with the music for this game, because I was copyright claimed for every single episode I uploaded. Just saying. I doubt that any of the Asker devs will be watching my particular videos. However, it'd be nice to then not get copyright claims on every single episode. Right, let's take this big stone back to base. Oh, there's loads of water here. Look at all this water. Now I feel like we've built in the wrong place again. Well, actually, I could just make this all the farmland, can't I, down here? And, and that'll be fine. Waving at me. Just work. Get working. We've got stuff to do. 16, 16 seconds, my friend. And the next guy will be here. Okay, it's all long sticks. Okay, there's that one. So we now have a guy. Can I not? No, we can't. Or is it right click? Nope, you have to drag them. Okay. Okay, and we have Excel in creating tools, weapons, and other workshop items. Natural born hunter. Um, I've endured numerous conflicts and skirmishes, and my scars have toughened me, enhancing my overall health. And daylight devotion. Um, should we take the craftsman? Natural born hunter as well. Let's take the grass person. Nana. Right. So I do have a builder now who's doing the building. Um, which is good. Um, but we do need to get a stone cutter's pit up and running. Um, and I think actually there's more stone over this way. Can I squeeze this in over here somewhere? that in over here. So there's a stone cutter's pit and then we want a gatherer's pit as well. Um, and there is absolutely loads of stuff to be gathered uh, all over the place actually. So I might actually put the gatherer's pit up here. Um, actually they're going to be turned into cottages later so maybe over here. 
was that weird to sort of offer an angle to the woodcutter. So stone cutters there. Maybe just behind. Not there. Right, loads of stuff to do, guys. Okay, rope and long sticks up here. So, do I have any... I can make three rope. Okay, so as soon as we get a certain number of people or a gathering station down, these things come in here to cause trouble. So, that's for my builder to make. We're going for it. Let's see if we can hit our goal this episode. That's going, the other one's going over there. I've got nothing to give these things with regards resources. Um, pick up these long sticks though. Just shove them in. There is stuff everywhere. You getting that one? Right, I need to go and find fiber. Um, whilst they load those up. So we're going to go out on a little hunt. Actually, whilst we're doing that, let's eat. <clears throat> oh, there's some Jason blood right here. That's good to know. There's also some fibre right here. Um, and I believe, actually, we can strip bark down into fibres, I think. Maybe we've, maybe we've got enough in base to do that. Let's grab some of these sticks. Stuck between two trees. There's the unattended bark. I mean, there's, there's berries in base as well. It's quite cool. So I think we can just harvest these. And it gives us fibres. Yes, I forgot about that. It's a shame you can't turn um, firewood into sticks. Right, so we've got... How much did I get then? Enough for five rope. That's great. Um, so those up there can be built. These guys... There's four rope there. There's one there, so I need three more. There's a stick there. Can't leave sticks lying around. Splinter. How much fibre have I got now? Four more, and we can make five rope. Oh, hang on. No, I was getting getting the flax, not the bark. We've got enough. Perfect. Four minutes until the other guy turns up. Okay. Gathering pit done. Hammer's about to break. Cheers, buddy. <laughs> Let's build another hammer. X 
excellent. Now, I believe he was a stone cutter. Um, and farmer. Proficient in stone mining, but I eat more. Yes, okay. So, manage workers. Stone cutter's pit. There you go, sir. And let's also give you somewhere to live. Sorted. Right, three minutes until this other guy turns up. Amazing. Um, and then we can go in here and um, we need a workshop. So this is a pretty big build. Um, we are not going to build this this time around, I don't think. Uh, also, there are trees that we can't knock down all over the place. So trying to find somewhere to slot this in might be a little bit of an issue. Um, let's try and let's try and find somewhere. I mean, we built in a forest. What about over the other side? So we'll have a production place over here, maybe? Okay, what about there? Okay, we need the workshop in order to make um, farming tools. And last time I felt like we were running out of food all the time. And I really want to get a nice big farm going. Um, and I also want my guys to be able to defend themselves, which last time was a problem. Well, you could place workshops everywhere just to level the place and then dismantle them. You'd have this nice flat terrain. Okay, our guy turns up in one minute. Um, we need how many more rope? Two more rope. Do I have any bark lying around? I mean, we'll have this place cleared of trees in no time. Two more. Two, please. There we go. The villager trifecta. So we've got our ex we've got our other villager now. Excellent. Um, let's give them somewhere to sleep. Homeless Nana, who is, who's actually, who's actually going to be our um, crafter um, in the workshop. Um, so I need to actually get somebody else on the go, uh, ready for the next one, who can actually gather plants. So why don't we go up here and start grabbing the Jotun... Oh, I've got two Jotun blood things right here. I was running around for ages looking for these things. Best seen at night because they glow. If we get these two and we 
can choose somebody for the next episode who can gather. I'll be pretty happy with that. That'd be pretty decent progress, I think, today. I do need two, two Jason blood at least out of this one. We don't sleep. Come on, three would be nice. We're not going to get three, are we? We'd be lucky to get two. Wow. It's a pretty lame one. We'd very much like three out of this one. And to not have to make my pickaxe again. This one. I mean, out of all of that Jason blood, we managed to chip off three or two little bits. Small stones everywhere, large stones. We'll drag that back to camp. I do have a stone cutter. We can chuck this in. Um, is there a large stone? Okay. So I've got four. I need to get one more. Okay, we need one more. Uh, gonna take a drink. And eat some berries and then go look in the darkness for Jason blood it's up here it's not wolves it's okay I don't see any Jason blood up here and the other thing is um, our pickaxe is nearly broken. Okay, there's a couple up here. That's fine. Okay, non-aggressive animals. Please get one before the pickaxe breaks. Uh, God. I need two blades. We can make five blades. Let's just make five blades. Right, okay. I'm going to eat you in a minute. Right, there we go. Might as well finish this. Seeing as we are here. You can always use the altar as a storage. There we go. Um, also. Help the stone cutter out. loaded with goodies. So let me know in the comments, are you playing this game? Are you enjoying this game? How long have you survived for? What do you like? What don't you like? 
Um, I look forward to hearing. Let's just um, set a large stone there. Let's put this one near it. Right, um, craftsman. I run longer, I sleep more often. Natural born hunter. It's this unwavering mental fortitude. Let's get leaf. Um, the leaf is going to be our gatherer for now. Six large, long sticks. Do I have six in storage? I have seven in storage. That's the perfect amount. It's one more than I need. That's all I ask for at all times. over here. So we've got another person in. Uh, I know we need to build another shelter. We will get on that. Um, whilst I load this up, I'm going to say thank you so much for joining me for some more Aska today. We are... Um, yeah, we are... We are moving along. Uh, we're gonna have four villagers when this uh, when leaf turns up, um, and uh, I think it's pretty good going after a couple of episodes. So I think in the next one we're gonna concentrate on upgrading some of our buildings um, because I want to get onto farming as soon as we possibly can this time round. We've got loads of farmable space out there. Um, we're gonna make some upgraded tools as soon as this workshop's done, and we are uh, yeah gonna push on for farming. And then, and then we'll be running around trying to get more Jason blood to get as many villagers as possible. Uh, basically, Ooh, scoot past that guy. People be running around doing stuff. Um, yeah, and hopefully we can take it a little bit further than uh, we got last time. Is that guy bringing this stick over here? He is. Excellent. So whilst I finish the workshop pit, I'm going to wish you guys a great rest of your day. I look forward to seeing you around in the next one. And until then, guys, take care of yourselves and stay safe out there.